How would you like to sew a simple skirt in an afternoon? I'm going to show you how easy it is in this short video. Hi, I'm Angela Wolf. An elastic waist skirt sews up super fast and looks great on all body types. I'm going to be using this cute ray skirt pattern from Sewaholic Patterns, but the techniques would apply to similar styles. Cut out and mark your six pattern pieces. Pin one front side to one back side piece with right sides together at the side seam line. Now stitch the seam with a 5 8 inch seam allowance. I'm using contrasting threads so you can see the stitches better, but you would use a matching thread. Next, just stitch the remaining five seams the same way. Stitch the seam, finish the edges, and press the seams open. Now let's go to the iron and prepare the elastic casing and the hem. It's faster if we press both in one stop. I'll show you only part of the skirt here so you can see what I'm pressing. This is the top edge where the elastic will go. Turn under the fabric edge one and three quarter inches and press. Then fold under the raw edge half an inch and press again. This is the perfect width for one inch elastic. We will be stitching along this folded edge, leaving a two inch opening to insert the elastic. Now let's move to the hem. Flip the raw edge up one and three quarter inches towards the wrong side of the fabric and press. Then tuck the raw edge under about three quarters of an inch and press. Now the hem is ready for top stitching. But first, let's finish our elastic casing. Line up the fabric so the needle is about an eighth of an inch from the folded edge. Start stitching about an inch away from the side seam and stitch all the way around. As you get back to where you started stitching, you want to leave approximately two inches open. Back stitch to secure the threads. Before you insert the elastic, you need to determine how tight you want it. Wrap the elastic around your waist and use a pin to hold it closed. Make sure it's not too tight and not too loose. Use a fabric pen to mark where the elastic should cross on both the outside and the inside of the elastic. Now I know after I insert the elastic into the casing, these two markings need to meet. You can use a bodkin or a safety pin attached to the end of the elastic to insert the elastic into the casing and ease it through until you get all the way around. Check that the elastic is not twisted. Overlap the two markings and stitch right across them to secure the elastic. Change to a zigzag stitch and stitch back and forth a couple of times. Trim off the excess elastic and all that is left is to stitch this little opening closed. Now let's finish up the hem that we prepped earlier. Top stitch along the folded edge around the skirt. And you're finished. You have a brand new skirt in a couple of hours. Thanks for watching and don't forget you click on the I in the top right corner of this video to learn more sewing techniques or to get the pattern I've been using in this video.